All right, protecting your reproductive legacy is what this is about, and that's gonna sound awful. This is not about eugenics. This is just about if you think you might wanna have kids someday, maybe take this into consideration for their health and well-being. So for women, we are born with all of the eggs that we are ever going to have. And for men, you will continually make sperm throughout your life once you start making sperm. I don't know exactly what happens when you get old. Maybe you stop making it, maybe it's just super mutated and like you can't. I don't know, to be honest. But I know that I have exposed myself to a lot of chemicals in my life. I've exposed myself to, I've taken jobs where I was exposed to, um, you know, herbicides and pesticides, fungicides, insecticides, lots of sides, um, automotive chemicals, um, industrial chemicals, construction waste. Um, I've been exposed to asbestos. I think a lot of my doing these things which were not necessarily well paying <laughs> or necessary um, had to do with my desire to just show that as a woman, as a petite woman, that I was capable of doing anything that anybody else was, which I'm not necessarily capable of doing anything, but I'm capable of doing a lot of things, and I didn't necessarily need to prove that, and since I did really want to have children, there is a part of me that really feels like at some point, even though I, I knew this, if you had asked me, some point somebody should have maybe said, you know, in the long run, if you're planning to have children, it would be a good idea to minimize, minimize your exposure to chemicals that could negatively impact your children or your own ability to successfully reproduce. So now I'm going to say that. You know, if you think you might want to have kids someday, don't put your phone by your testicles. Don't put your phone in your bra. Don't do things that are going to harm your reproductive organs or your eggs or your sperm. Because it's not just your life that you could potentially be making more difficult. It's generations of lives that you could potentially be making more difficult. Just think about it a little bit when you decide what jobs you want to do or what projects you're going to take on or what protective wear you're going to put on 